Hello, my name is Kate and I'm the Teen Services Librarian at the North Vancouver City Library. Today, in honor of Orange Shirt Day, I'd like to talk to you about a couple of graphic novels that I'd like to recommend on the topic of missing and murdered Indigenous girls. Uh, the first one is called If I Go Missing, and this is written by Brianna Johnny uh, with Nahani Shinkus and art by Injana Kapo. This book is based on a letter that Brianna Johnny wrote to the chief of police in her town. She was wondering why when someone like her goes missing, she's Ojibwe, um, does, is there not the swift response that she sees when a white person goes missing? And this book is um, beautifully illustrated and you see it's minimal in terms of color, um, but it's very detailed. And um, Brianna, um, is, this is actually based on the letter that Brianna wrote, um, so it's really um, non-fiction. Uh, and um, I wanna just show you, let's see here. So she wrote the letter when she was just 14 and she was inspired um, as a young girl uh, to this issue when she came across the red dress installation, art installation in Winnipeg. Um, so I think you'll find this a, a very um, uh, intense and quick read um, to just go into uh, what, hap what she would hope for herself um, if she went missing what would she hope and and just explaining that to the police department the second book i wanted to talk about is called surviving the city and this is um, by tasha spillett with natasha donovan the illustrations are absolutely beautiful um, this is a book about best friends des and me kwan and um, Des is living with her grandmother and her grandmother gets ill and when this happens um, she is faced with the looming threat of having to move into a group home. The illustrations are um, colorful and uh, really beautiful. Um, there is a lot of, of important uh, information here about um, the history of trauma in the community. Um, when Des actually goes missing because she can't face the reality of the group home and she can't come home to her grandmother, Mi Kwan is and the community are searching for her. And will they be able to find her before it's too late? Mi Kwan is especially scared because her mother had already gone missing and is missing. So um, this one is another um, really intense and quick read and I recommend it to um, everyone and this these two graphic novels can be found in the library um, and so definitely come and check it out and let us know if you have any questions I hope you have a wonderful week